Hi, let's learn about Roman numerals. The Romans showed numbers into the thousands using these seven symbols. I for one, V for five, and so on. We still see Roman numerals on some clocks and buildings. They work like this. I for one, I, I for two, I, I, I for three. And then to make four, they put a one in front of a five to mean one less than five. Then V for five. Then V, I, meaning one more than five for six. Did you see that? Putting one before five makes four, but putting it after five makes six. Seven, eight, and then to make nine, they put a one in front of a 10 to mean one less than 10. Then X for 10, X I for 11. Putting one before 10 makes nine, but putting it after 10 makes 11, 12, and so on. Example, X X X I V means 34. Three X's means three tens. Then a one in front of the five means four. Together, that is 34. When we reach 40, we put a 10 in front of a 50 to mean 10 less than 50. Then L for 50, LX for 60, and so on. To make 90, put a 10 in front of a 100 to mean 10 less than 100. Example, XCIX. 10 less than 100 means 90. Then one less than 10 means nine. Together, that is 99. C is 100. CC is 200. CCC is 300. And CD means 400. Why? Because it is 100 less than 500. D is 500, and so on. Lastly, we come to M, which means 1,000. Example, M, C, M, I, X. M is 1,000. C, M is 100 less than 1,000, so 900. I, X is one less than 10, so nine. Together, that is 1,909. To convert to Roman numerals, Break the number into thousands, hundreds, tens, and units. Then convert each. Example, 1984. Break it into 1,000, 900, 80, and four. 1,000 is M, 900 is CM, 80 is LXXX, and four is IV. Done. To put your new knowledge into practice, try the Your Turn questions here.